Need tools? We've got you covered. Go to Chromebookparts.com or click on the link below to pick up this sleek, portable toolkit. Flip the unit over and remove four 7.5 mm screws and six 6 mm screws from the bottom cover and bottom cover panel. Pop the bottom cover panel free. And use the spudger to also pop the battery plug panel free. Slide the lock and clip open and unplug the battery from the motherboard. Flip open the locking clips and unplug the daughterboard cables from the motherboard. Flip open the locking clip and unplug the touchpad cable from the motherboard. Flip open the locking clip and unplug the palm rest cable from the motherboard. Peel back the tape. And unplug the LCD cable from the motherboard. It may help to unseat the cable first. Unplug the sensor board cable from the motherboard. Unplug the camera cable from the motherboard. Remove the foam covering. Flip open the locking clip and unplug the world-facing camera from the motherboard. Flip open the locking clip and unplug the microphone cable from the motherboard. Gently pull up to unplug the Wi-Fi antennas from the motherboard. Flip the unit over, open it up, Gently insert the opener pick between the palm rest and the bottom cover and slide along the edges to pop the palm rest free. Carefully lift the palm rest partway up. Peel back the tape and pull the touchpad cable through its slot. Remove four 3mm screws and three 4mm screws from the motherboard. Gently lift up and pull back on the motherboard, taking care not to bend or damage the ports. When the motherboard is free, unplug the speakers from the motherboard.
plug the speakers back into the motherboard. And lay the motherboard down back into place, taking care not to bend or damage the ports as you get them in their slots. Be sure to remove any cables out from underneath the motherboard. Replace the four 3mm screws and three 4mm screws into the motherboard. Replace the palm rest. And feed the microphone cable and world facing camera cables back into their slots. Feed the touchpad cable back into its slot and reapply the tape. And lastly, feed the palm rest cable back into its slot as you lower the palm rest. Push down to snap the palm rest back into place. Close the unit and flip it back over. Replace the four 5mm screws back inside the bottom panel. Plug the daughterboard cables back into the motherboard. The orange daughterboard cable can be a little difficult at times, so just be patient and try not to use too much force. Plug the touchpad cable back into the motherboard. Plug the palm rest cable back into the motherboard. Plug the camera cable back into the motherboard. Reseat the LCD cable back into its grooves and plug it back into the motherboard. Plug the sensor board cable back into the motherboard. And reseat the cable back into its grooves.
Gently push down to plug the Wi-Fi antennas back into the motherboard. Plug the world-facing camera back into the motherboard. Plug the microphone cable back into the motherboard. Replace the foam coverings. And replace the tape. Plug the battery back into the motherboard and slide the locking clip closed. Replace the battery plug panel and replace the bottom cover panel. Replace the four 7.5mm screws and six 6mm screws into the bottom cover and bottom cover panel. 